Okay, today is day four. Uh, I have to make this video pretty quick because I'm about to go to work. Um, but I had two fish die yesterday, and I think it's because, well, the pH is 8.5, and I think it's a combination of that and um, the ammonia buildup in the system since there's no nitrifying bacteria in the grow bed yet to break it down into nitrites and nitrates. Um, so today's Monday so hopefully it'll come in the mail today if not most likely tomorrow um, I'll have to check when I get off of work tonight but yeah so two of them died I'm not feeding them uh, today so they can go 24 hours without food so hopefully they won't poop as much and uh, I learned that another thing is I learned that ammonia is in more concentrations and higher pH ammonium which is not nearly as toxic as ammonia is more present at lower pH temperatures but it could take a whole year for the system's pH to lower naturally but it will and from what I learned you don't want to tamper with it too much just kind of let it do it naturally so that's what I'm doing um, I also wanted to show that I got some wheatgrass sprouting up I just planted it I think two days ago maybe three but it's coming up pretty quickly I put it around the edges in some places because um, I knew it would pop up pretty quickly and didn't it wouldn't take up too much space. I didn't want it close to the other plants. Um, I put a whole bunch of seeds in here. But yeah, that's it. Today is day four, and that's the update. Today is day five, um, well, night of day four, but it's past midnight, almost 1 a.m. So it is day five. I just got home from work and this was in the mail. Um, it's the nitrifying bacteria, microbe, microbe lift night out to nitrifying bacteria. And um, I need to go get an ammonia tester tomorrow so I can test the water after I put this in. But it says for new tanks to put a teaspoon uh, per 10 gallons. So this is a 27-gallon 20, tub, but I don't think it's completely 27 gallons full. So I'm just going to add two teaspoons, which would be for 20 gallons, which I'm going to do right now. And, oh, I got, I got a measuring cup. Thank you. Let me get this off of here. Hmm. There's scissors in there. Alright, I got it. I'm gonna shake it up one more time. It says to shake well. Okay, so teaspoons. And it's got this cool little measuring cup on top too and it says to keep this stuff refrigerated and the shelf life is 12 to 18 months um, depending on storage conditions it says but for maximum shelf life store in a cool place and it says refrigerated as possible so there's one teaspoon Alright, so that should keep any more fish from dying and should get the system started and the plants able to uh, take out the ammonia by, well, they don't directly take out the ammonia, the bacteria I just added will convert the ammonia into nitrites and then into nitrates which will get uh, absorbed by the plants. So yeah, that is it for today.